Hello, subscribers and viewers to Raw Tarot. That's Romance at Work here at Spirit Buys for the Earth Elements. Sun, Moon, Rising on the Cups and North Node. Stay woke and enjoy. All right, Earth Elements, Sun, Moon, Rising, Cups and North Node. Welcome back to Raw Tarot. This is your Raw Points to your raw story for interlude two, scenario two. Um, I want to go ahead and just sort of refresh your mind on last scenario's um, major points, masculine and feminine, or feminine and masculine, where the central issue was the lovers. Now, I don't remember why the lovers' energy was established, but we're going to find that out for this scenario for you. It may be new, it may be the same, I don't know as well as the overall energy for scenario two and the basis for that and clarity. And um, as you know, for scenario for interlude two, the feminines are represented by the two of swords, which stems from the reverse chariot. There was some decision being made regarding transportation or a decision had been made um, around transportation. Like I said, you were stuck here or... I don't know, for some of you, it could have been an accident, but traveling was an issue. How to get where you were going was an issue, whereas the male um, is De La Croix. Uh, he's a decision maker. Um, he's kind of like um, the lower octane of the king of pentacles energy. So he uh, makes decisions too, but he makes a lot of decisions based on how it is going to affect him okay um whether it's just going to make him feel good to he or she whether you if you're in masculine energy whether you it just makes you feel good to do something or because you gave them something you provided a service or they want to hire you something of that nature okay whereas the king of pentacles you ask you shall receive but like i always tell you all if you go into the king of pentacles you better know what you want to ask for now, the masculine's energy is stemming from the Queen of Cups. This is an assistant, a psychic of type. Um, he, 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 he is stemming from some help, some assistance. An assistant, um, like I said, some insight. Um, this could be a person who is going to offer you something. Maybe you're going to go out for breakfast or something. This was last scenario. So we're going to find out where you are in this scenario um, in terms of your points. Now, your central issue was the lovers. And we know that the lovers brings about confusion. You know, there are mishaps and in the um, interferences and things when it comes to the lovers. But there was some kissing bedfellows. I believe it was you. Kissing bedfellows was in this situation. Um... That could even be, um, well, it could be a betrayal of sorts or someone who has a choice between two, okay? This is a neighborhood card as well. Um, the mishap, the confusion, interference can also deal with siblings, okay? Your neighbors, okay? It could be anybody, but we're going to find out for scenario two why the lovers is the central issue for you, as well as the overall energy and the basis. Can we get that, please, this source for our Earth elements? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and On the Cups, and North Node, please. Okay, it's based on the hangman reverse. It has something to do with this. some answers that you, something that you know, some enlightenment you receive. Now, I don't know what it was for last scenario. You need to go back and view that video. And at the same time, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up as well as checking the description box for information on how to contact me in the event that you would like to schedule a reading, whether it's pertaining to raw tarot, work and money, or just something personal to you, um, deceased readings, and um, your raw story, which is only $4.99. The overall energy is the page of wands reverse and that is based on the hierophant okay so this week 
I really feel like the energy has changed. Okay, your reading for some interlude two, scenario two is based on loyalty and commitment, a home. This could be your job as well, wherever there are rules established that if you want to be here, um, this is these these are the precepts that you have to follow. Okay. It could be a society, an organization, like I said, it could be your job. Um, and you're making a choice, feminines about your commitment because this is all about commitment whatever it is you commit it okay this also could be um a marriage this could also be a marriage okay so maybe you have found romance at work and you happen to make a choice feminines based on somebody that's married because you're stuck or you did with this scenario, you will be. Some some of you, this person is married or uh, uh, committed. Others, this is based on your commitment at work. Or this, for some of you, is this lover. You can see how these two are here. The two heads. And then you got the two snakes. Okay? So I know for a fact, it's a choice being made between two or a decision being made you know, um, regarding a commitment. Now, the masculines seem to be making a commitment. Reciprocity. That's what this is. This is reciprocity. This is reciprocity based on a commitment for the masculines. This could have been um, at work. This could be at somebody's house or home. Okay? Like I do readings for people that I know in my home um, or, you know, I will, but um, this could have been a decision about giving service. Okay. Masculines, this could also be about finding a place to stay. This could be about buying a home. When it comes to your romance, maybe this Queen of Cups is the masculine's feminine and they're about to, um, you know, purchase some purchase a home together or rent, whatever. Right. But the overall energy for you, Earth elements in romance and work is the page of wands reversed. And this energy is like they're rethinking their passion for somebody. Uh, uh, or they're thinking about starting up something with somebody. Okay, and this more than likely is another person because I see too many twos and too many decisions to be with a connection. Um, and for the feminines, you're wondering if you like this person. Is somebody you're wondering if you like? Or did, did you wondering if you would like to start something up with them? Or you're wondering if they like you? It's kind of in the brushes. You know, you don't, it's, you know, it's a lot going on before you really know. Um, let's get some, let's clarify. Um, let me see, do we need to clear, I don't think we need to, I think we need to clarify this hangman because the hangman is all about illumination. And um, the full card is, re is, is clarified by the full card. It was par probably partly cloudy that day, partly sunny that day. When you decided to just take a chance, or you were starting something new, or This is something you took a chance with. You just, you felt it and you just took a leap of faith. That's what this illumination is regarding this lover's card in your neighbor. This is a neighborhood card. Wherever this is, this love is in your vicinity, in your neighborhood. Okay. 
and this is based on some some enlightenment that you receive. It was a partly sunny day, or you know what I'm saying, and you took a leap of faith. Now, for the feminines, this has to be in reference to you making this choice regarding transportation. For masculines, this has to be whatever it is that you want to finance or a, a, a type of uh, exchange between two is the reason why you um, took this chance. Like I said, this could be a payment from this queen of cups, this assistant, this helpful one. And maybe, um, and maybe, maybe she paid to take him home or he paid to take her home. Who knows? But cause this is a house, this is a home, this is, or to work, whatever commitment she had, it, it, there was definitely some finances going on here. But I feel like overall, somebody is wondering and thinking that they probably feel some type of way about somebody, some type of passion, you know, some, some steam, some, some, some sexual feeling. Okay. Let's find out what the feminine and masculine special message is for interlude two scenario two, top and bottom, please. For feminine's top, masculine's on the bottom. What are your special messages, dear source, for feminine and masculine for interlude two scenario two in romance at work? Feminines, you have the temperance card, right? And that is stemming from the Seven of Wands. Masculines, you have the King of Pentacles. You're in your energy, right? And that is stemming from the Queen of Swords. Okay, so feminines. Whatever it is that you're working on, whatever this thing that you've been fighting for, that you've been holding on to, that you feel strong about, you need to go ahead and put it out there. You need to go ahead and um, experiment by putting it out there and seeing what's going to unfold, okay? It's no more holding back. You've done enough experimentations. You've done enough trying to see how it's going to work, okay? You, it's time to come out of the lab, okay, and get to work, okay? Putting it out there. Masculines, special message. Um, You need to consider, because the King of Pentacles considers finances, money. Masculines, you need to consider financing something, or you need to consider an offer that stemmed from this advisor. This is a very wise, intelligent, highly intelligent woman. She's good at giving directives, great advice. She's a great coach, okay? She has a lot of great insight, just like the Queen of Cups. This could be the same person. But you're thinking about it, or you will be thinking about financing Something, this home, this this work. Because whatever it is, you're hooked. You're hooked. And it's probably stemming from this advisor. She's probably the one that told you what you need to do with your money or how to go about your money or what you will do with your money if this is the same person. Okay? Yeah, so um, let's find out where you are in the scheme of things, masculine and feminine, from last scenario to this scenario. Where are you in the scheme of things when it comes to romance and work, feminines and masculines in this scenario? Feminines, oh wow, you got the Ten of Swords. Masculines, you have the three of cups. Okay, 
So, hmm. um, you're done, feminums. You take it. You're over it. You're done. You're finished. You're over it. You're tired. You're tired. You're not doing this no more. We're not doing work in <laughs> romance in <laughs> Based on this hair fine, it could be these rules. It could be the laws of the hair fine. This could be where the hair fine is stationed. But whatever it is, it's quitting time. It's a wrap. I see a crucifixion here. Yeah. And masculines, I hear you singing and whistling and uh, feeling a little pulse in your heart. You're ready to make something happen. You're ready to produce something. And this could be music. This could be a product or a service. Um, but you're ready to put something together. And it's possible that three will be involved. And I'm going to leave it right here. Hopefully, I'll see you over at The Raw Story. It's only $4.99. Thank you for dropping in. And I can't wait until Interlude 2, Scenario 3. Until the next one, take care of yourself and each other. Peace. One love.